Kevin Doherty, Drogheda United manager, unfortunately uh, a 4-1 defeat here in Richmond Park. What are your thoughts on the game? Um, ah, look, obviously the second half played a massive part. Um, again, it was fairly, we were fairly, we were okay. Whatever, 20 odd minutes. I, I don't even know when, when to go, but then we go and obviously the sending off, as I said, they get out to 10 men. These, these are flying, they're in good form. They've been playing really, really well in Europe and when they have the extra man, um, it was really difficult. But probably the, and there's a number of disappointing elements to it, as in we get back and equalise, and then we get we get to one. I, I think defensively we were really poor tonight, um, but we got ourselves back one all, and I can see it a minute later. Like it's so bad, it's so easy to get the cross into the box. So disappointed with that. Then obviously you <laughs> win message at half time, keep it right, and we we have a go in the last, and then we can see it again. And then I thought we actually played okay, like. And look, as I said, the extra man like it was very difficult, but and it wasn't like the last minute, last few minutes extra man. It was like a, a good portion of the game, um, and then a three-one. Like you know, it sounds really, really defeatist, but you probably should, like shouldn't concede again, and, and, and we put in a, a poor cross when, when it shouldn't have happened, and then they break and score again in four-one. And look, as I said, the story of the game probably look Pats are an excellent side. They didn't need any help, but we gave them a bit of help with the sending off and, and some of the defending Is it the pace they have especially when you're trying to cover that bit more space when you're down to 10 men Is that was that the big difference? <laughs> they were very look they're very quick in wide areas but so are we mm. we just got to one we just got to stop like we just look again and, and I say it's not I'm not calling anyone out we've been unbelievable we've been brilliant for the last 7-8 weeks both defensively yeah. and probably defenders were poor tonight um, but look that happens um, and you just have to defend better, stop crosses coming into the box. And then when they do come into the box, you've got to defend them better, you've got to save them going into the net, you've got to come and stop. Like, I mean, we gave away a lot of corners, but that was because, as I said, look, the Pats are an excellent side, like, they're really, really good. So they didn't need any help with the, but we gave them it with the, with the sending off as well. There was a stoppage in the first half. Douglas James Taylor seemed to be talking to Rob Hennessy, the referee, about something that was potentially said. I, I'm not sure what it was about. I don't know. Can you shed any light on it or talk about it? Look, I don't know if it was, if it was announced on the thing, but. There was a racist comment made from, from the from the crowd, and that's just not acceptable. Um, it's hard to believe, to be honest. And I asked Dougie was okay, and he, and, and he was, but um, I'm sure everyone at St. Pat's will, will will agree with that. It was it was awful, absolutely awful. Yeah, okay, well, I'm sure it'll be investigated. Uh, how do you bounce back from this? Or is it a case of, you know what, you're away to St. Pat's, things went against you, guy was sent off. You can kind of accept it and move on. Yeah, it's hard to accept. As I said, it, 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 as, as as poor as it sounds, at three one, it was nearly like, oof, look, we just we just get in and, and we've had a tough night. And but the four one made made it a little bit harder. But um, yeah, as I said, look, we've been on a tremendous run. The lads have been excellent. We defended really, really well, and obviously scored a lot of goals. Tough night tonight. I, I look, you have to be really realistic completely different game probably if we keep 11 on the pitch as I said it wasn't like he, we, did, we lost a man for the last 5-10 minutes um, we lost him for most of the game and, and uh, against a team with really good individuals and, and lads that are well coached and in rotations and having that extra player we changed formation a few times to try and shore it up and, and look as I said there was periods in the game where we actually did okay yeah. but yeah look like last week when we had to move on quickly from the 7-0 win we have to move on quickly from this. No game next week, obviously, so you probably have to wait. Give us more time to work for that and be ready for the Cup game. Cheers, Kevin. Thanks, Oshin. Thank you.